Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, it is the 1st of August. Happy August Fool's Day. So thrilled to be playing a game with old school design mentality. Ooh, or should I say old school design sentimentality. We're going to play the brand newly released Deadly Rooms of Death Second Sky. If you've never played Deadly Rooms of Death, don't worry. We're going to hop right into it. We're going to be doing the tutorial. And uh, because it's brand new, first time ever streamed, I have no idea how the audio sounds. So live chat's going to let me know, and if this is on YouTube, you have the day-night sub chat to thank. So I'm going to show you how this thing works. Let's do this. Let's go to the tutorial where it will all make sense. This is one of, in my eyes, the greatest puzzle games, the greatest puzzle systems of all time. I love this so much. The game is called Deadly Rooms of Death. The tutorial was created in 2004, but the actual, um, the game itself, I believe, was made, uh, 2014, 2013. It's, very, it's pretty new. Actually, I'm gonna look it up right now. Uh, Deadly Rooms, uh, Rooms of Death, Second Sky. Uh, and I'm the first hit. Boom. Uh, where's Caravel Games? CaravelGames.com Again, one of the greatest games. What is this? It was released. More info. When were you released? Tell me when you were released. I don't know. I believe it's new. I have no idea. They're trying to get greenlit on Steam. Bethro, let's get your lesson started. To move, you press the keys on your numeric keypad. Eight for up, two for down, four for left, six for right. See Follow this? me up to the north room and we'll continue. Turn-based puzzle. Easy. And see, I have a sword and I can rotate it. It just got greenlit. That's fantastic. When you feel ready to play the real game, you can quit this tutorial at any time. Alright. See how this works? See, we're gonna... See, it's, it's turn-based thus far. Audio could be turned up a touch. You've got it. You've got it. You've got it. You'll need to use your sword, too, of course. Of course. The W and Q keys will turn your sword clockwise and counterclockwise. Hit the two orbs in this room to open the yellow doors. I think I'm gonna need to be, to be over here. So let's move me. So see, I can rotate and hit objects. I have a feeling this is gonna be too loud right now. So you notice my voice right, when that happened? Well, could you hear me over it? You should always be able to hear me. Let's make sure you can move diagonally. Use the seven, nine, one, and three keys for that. Follow Beautiful. me. Beautiful. Beautiful. Press five to wait instead of making a move. Now that might seem weird. Press five to wait instead of making a move, but it's gonna make sense in a sec. It's gonna make a lot of sense. Press R at any time to restart the current room. Press R. five to wait instead of making a move. Look at that. Move undo. Alternatively, pressing backspace will allow you to undo the last move you've made. Just one. Loud when hitting objects. All right, that's what I thought. We're gonna we're gonna pull down to twenty five percent. We're gonna be. It. You can configure undo settings by clicking change settings. Whatever, it's fine. Checkpoints. See when I touch the X. Watch this. Touch this is a checkpoint. You hear that? Boom. And watch, if I hit restart, it sends me back to that checkpoint. And if I hit R again, it sends me back another checkpoint. Super puzzles. See? Look, it just told me just told me the same thing that I just already did. Look, I should be the tutorial. Minimap, observe the minimap. Observe it now that my face is out of the way. Alright. Well, that's the end of the lesson. You've graduated clearing school. You didn't even explain how to fight monsters. What are you, some kind of baby? Well, if you really must, take the passageway to the east for a good lesson. But if you think you can figure things out on your own, go down the stairs. Also, if you're the type that doesn't like listening to speeches, you can skip playing dialogue by pressing space <laughs> at any time. Secret rooms. There are several secret rooms hidden throughout the game. They provide a special challenge for experienced players, but it is not required to find or conquer any of them to win the game. 
Clearing all secret rooms at some point will master the hold, enabling you to access top secret bonus areas hidden behind master walls. You may press enter at any time to view information about your play in the current room. Oh. Perfect. All right, so we're gonna we're gonna finish the tutorial in a little bit, and then we're gonna talk to you. We're gonna talk to you, great great human chats. What is known? Take this route to learn some of the monsters. Okay, cool. So I'm gonna. Okay, so here's the thing. This is the most important concept of the entire game. Whenever I take a move, then everybody else takes a move. So see all these roaches that are in front of me. Look at that. I take a move. They move. So see this this hero on the top? Who's rotating to hurt things? So I want you to look. Well, I'm, I'm going to turn my sword. Uh-oh. He's going to kill me. Smack down. So now I can... And whenever you hear me go... <laughs> I cleared the level. Good work. Use the battle key plus on the numeric keypad by default to mirror your last move. Holding this down may be helpful when fighting large horde of monsters. No, I'm not going to do that. Ever. Oh, now here's something interesting. See this clock in the left that says 30? This guy's going to spawn roaches in a second. So as I get to new areas, see I have to be kind of careful to get myself into a good position. Remember to point your sword in the right direction. Yeah. So it's, it's very, you must focus on, uh-oh. So I'm going to do this and this and this. And this and that. Perfect. Alright, I think we get the tutorial. Do we get it? I think we get it. I think we get it. So once we get started... Oh, we get a cutscene. I'm Beefo Budkin, Smite Master. I spent years cleaning out city sewers, cellars, roach-infested basements, you name it. But after clearing out old King Duggan's dungeon, I suspected something odd was going on beneath. You see... The dungeon was originally nine floors deep. But later, my grandpa Guntro discovered it had unexpectedly grown to 15 levels, so I decided to get to the bottom of things. When I went in, it went down 25 levels deep. That's when I learned something unexpected, something sinister, was taking place beneath. Oh yeah. Guys, do, do we want to watch a few minutes of backstory with spoilers from previous games prior to starting? I mean, I'm going to go with yes. You've trespassed into the Empire's space unannounced. There are some <laughs> places for Budkins to be, and this isn't one of them. You've delved too deep. We want you to go home. What kind of operation you run? I want answers. Mr. Budkin, here beneath, the Empire concerned itself with a grand variety of important tasks. What does the Empire want? Knowledge of everything that will, might, or ought to have been. Fine. Why is this dungeon growing in size past its original plans? I'm trying to tell you. It's not really a dungeon, by the way. We call them holes. <laughs> I learned from a thing in a pit that this underground empire is going crazy. The archivists have two jobs. One that was given to them, and one they gave themselves. They were told to collect information, but when they listened more deeply to the nothingness, the nothingness told them to collect all information. I learned that the Empire was in cahoots with the DAA, and they were using my nephew, Alf. You want to hang out with these guys? They're evil. They work for the Empire, which wants to kill the surfacers. No, you know, the archivists want to kill the surfacers. The DAA works for the patronage. I, the patronage is. I'm not to learning anything. I'm just Look confused. Out. You can hear a lot of different things down here. And it's hard to make sense of it. That's why I need to get to lowest point and talk to who's in charge there. Hey, what are you guys doing here? Surround. 28 4 We are patrons. Patrons of I'm skipping because I don't I don't know what's happening. I have no idea what this is. We're gonna play a new game. We're gonna play a new game. 
space bar to skip. You've trespassed into the Empire. All right, space bar. I from a space bar. I space bar. I was in cahoots with the Spa DEA. Space bar. Hey, what are you? Space bar. I've spent my life. To space it. bar. It didn't make much sense at first. Space. I learned a terrible secret. Space. In any event, the Empire. Health wouldn't share any secret. And this didn't make much sense. And it. And it's just a space bar. Stuff, what? excitement, things. Urban gaming elite gets it. This. I. I. All right. Choose a destination. Older holding that. Our chemist was ever a job. There was a rather clandestine sect in the rooted empire called the Alchemists, or so the dustier of our annals tell us. The dustier of our annals. As if your chosen function in life, as determined by your vat recipe, is something other than your chemical makeup. All right. But that raises the question, doesn't it? Oh, Greek TV, what up? What came before the first vat born? No, I think this is a truth we need to consider. The Empire's entire current structure is hinged upon the brilliance of past individuals who were decidedly not that born. Thus, an observation must be made that calls into question the efficacy of our current system. Hope it goes through. All right, awesome. We, we are starting out. We're at the entrance. Do I have this vessels? How long are they going to take to get back? You ask me that every day. How could I know? How could anybody know? Look, first chemist, I can't wait forever. <sighs> this empire, it's moving, doing things. Some of them, I sort of maybe understand. And other motions are hidden from view. Or you are too close to observe. Exactly. So maybe, right now, there is some batch of new slayers brewing up. Or you know, something even worse. As There's much not. as I appreciate effort that I goes into story, this is one of the greatest the are purely maintenance puzzle games. Replacements for losses. And I want to play puzzles. Security has picked up considerably, and the old Slayer recipe is unauthorized there. Hey, we cooked up these vessels without anybody knowing. We just didn't use the main vats, so the archivists can do it too. Can do it too. I think there are a lot of things to worry about. A lot of too things many. To no worry kidding. About. Well, if there is no answer to something. What good comes from worrying about it? It just means the problem is like tar. I'm stabbing it wrong. When I'm I stab it at the right place, it, it wrong. breaks up. Ah, you like those violent metaphors involving stabbing and slicing. I don't even know what's being talked about. Chopping is very important. Anyhow, all this time cooped up with nothing but books, I've got a pretty good handle of True Tongue. But it's been a month. I've been waiting for a month studying the True Tongue. For all I know, armies have gone up and smashed the Eighth to pieces. A vessel is returning. <gasps> In God Omit 5, Skywise Northwick's knots. In God Omit 5, <laughs> Skywise Northwick's knots. In God Omit 5, Skywise Northwick's knots. Oh my god, in God Omit 5. Hey, that's funny. Uh, my true tongue is a little shaky. What did they say? They called it a second sky. I guess that's true enough. Huh. D did you notice? They all took the exact same amount of time to answer? Sure, because they all said yeah. the same thing. No, Shinny Yukai's I mean, first puzzle, How to Get Out of the Lore. Sent them off a month ago. They all spent the same amount of time researching the answer. Probably they each used precisely the same method, the same steps, and thus arrived at the same answer independently. That's a theory. They could have just talked to each other before coming in, though. Then again, with that kind of planning, you'd think they'd respond to death threats and just wouldn't come back. Uh, so, are you going to kill the third one? Nah. Hey there, little buddy. I'm not gonna kill you. Don't worry. You did real good. Uh, you'd need to use the true tongue with him, remember? Oh, uh, right. Um, smart wise, grumpful, not pennant. Hmm, doesn't seem to care either way. Anyhow, I know what I'm asking next. Excellent. This time it should go so much faster. I want to get to a puzzle. 322 vessels. Badly. Delegation. Let oh, me get to a puzzle. Why didn't we use that many the first time? Hey, I suggested it. Okay, I, I'm you... skipping no... all of this. Go north. Okay, thank God. All right. Here's the thing. I'm not going to do any more cutscenes. I cannot figure out what the hell is going on. Let's actually play the game. All right. All right. 
So it, the goal in every single time, in every single uh, zone, is just As to clear you can it. See, all of the troop vessels are now actively applied to your question. Huh, I don't know what that means. I, I'm worried they're trying to teach me a puzzle mechanic. Monster alert. Oh! Fellow citizen, smite the dungeon roach to open the green security gate. Strike the orb with your sword to open the yellow doors. Excellent. All Fish right. plates can open and close yellow doors too. Think of a way to reopen the door. What? Think of a way to reopen the door? Okay. Smite that roach. So if I stand on pressure plates. Keep your sword oh, between I see. you and the enemy. Where? Hey, I guess you know what you're doing. Wait, what are you doing here anyway? We received a report that there's activity in this area. Automatic staffing protocols are in effect. My job is mostly to just hang out here and watch. Here's the tutorial. Some vessels will be tracking your whereabouts, so feel free to go wherever you want. A vessel will find you when an answer is ready. Great. Once I close that security gate, I'm going to Dugandy. No, I know nothing about the story. Lure the roach. Okay. Alright, see, we got this roach here. We're, go we're gonna bring him in. These arrows? I can't... I can't go the other way on them. I have to go the same way on them. <laughs> hey! Come over here! Alright, let's see if we can get to him. So this is a... Area I can knock down. Let me go talk to this dude. You know things can't go against the force arrows, right? That yeah. means you're not stuck here with me. Once that starts weirding you out, you can press restart to rewind the game back to when you stepped on the checkpoint X. Hitting R going back. Alright. Nothing interesting in here. It's no time to be napping. Alright, so there's actually nothing in here, is that right? I always look for secrets. Is there a secret wall here, maybe? Okay, now. How do you like my how do you like my tapping on that numpad, eh? Alright. C5? C5? Five, 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 five. We shouldn't have done the tutorial, we just should have done this. Okay, so we. This is one of the games where you can actually mess up. Okay, so I gotta. I gotta be careful with this. So let's wait, wait, and let's move right. Wait, wait, move right. Wait, 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 wait. Cool. Oh, whoops. So I gotta go around this to this side. <laughs> Starting to make sense? Starting to make sense, that good numpad micro? Watch your back. Okay. Alright, so far so good. Just trying to... Ooh, this, this, this... Okay, here is a motion that I don't know. I don't know if you could, uh... I don't know if you can know this unless you play one of the older ones. But you have to hit up and left. Because even though we all move at the same time, it registered mine first, so I can kill him here and there. Yeah. Oh, whoops. Alright, I we're going around. We're going around. I shouldn't have fallen for that. This is the Dark Souls of puzzle games, to be honest. Okay, watch for traps. Hints. Click on yellow doors, orbs, and pressure plates with your mouse to highlight their connections. That's a weird interface, but I'll do it.
Okay, I see. So I, I have to... I have to get through this maze. those pressure plates to keep the doors open. <laughs> hmm. All right, where are we going here? Did I already lock myself out? Oh, oh, wait. Alright, I'm pulling out. So we have to make sure that this roach, on the right side, doesn't activate the traps. Oh my god. Okay, so we gotta... See this roach at the right? He is... I gotta drag him over here. I gotta wait till he gets in there. Cool. Gotta not touch those pressure plates to keep the doors open. Oh, you roach asshole. Okay, I think I gotta get him stuck in this... In this little crevasse here. Alright, I think he's... Jesus. I gotta guide this roach here. I think we're doing it. Okay. So let's see. How do I get to the other side without having... Because I can't have him trigger this pressure plate. Because if he triggers this, it just shuts all the door. Whew. So now I gotta move around like this. Maybe? No, then he's gonna... Because if he hits this, he's going to trigger all those. Okay. Oh. oh! There, Allo says, this is boring. I'm so sorry. If it is boring, if it gets boring after uh, after the morning hours, we might just, we might just switch games. Hmm. This is like the fourth room, the rest of the game must be hard. Dude. Dude, this game is supremely tough. I'm actually not sure even how to get around this. Gotta not touch those pressure plates to- How do you get him to not- Have, have I already messed up? Oh my god. Hmm. Okay, I'm pulling back. So, we where, where are we trying to go? We're trying to... The green ones... I don't think we ever get to clear. Unless I can get... Okay, so I have to work my way over to here. And go through and kill these two Rochi guys. So I'm trying to think where this this fellow needs to be pulled. Wait, how do I, how do I affect this one? What affects that switch? This one? Are you kidding me? Oh my god. You, you go around outside. Okay. Alright, let's bring him in. Bring, 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 bring. Wait, maybe I can bring him down to that side? Oh, wait a minute. Now, if I do this and then I go down, can I get him in this area? Okay. Okay. Okay, we got him stuck. He's stuck right now. Okay. Okay, so far so good. Let's see if we can drag him over. Ooh, okay. Okay, and this is where I need to drag him up. Now I can get to that roach. Ha! Victory! Okay. Bring him down. Uh, and then there, and then there. Okay. Okay, so how can I get to this roachy guy? I think I, think I gotta go this way, but I gotta be really careful.
Oh, yes! Fourth level of the game. Fourth level of the game. <laughs> Alright. Hunting hard. Alright, I'm heading right. Choose your entrance. Well, I guess I'm the left one. Oh, whoops. So that affects this, that affects this. I like it. NX Lashale says, sick puzzle baller. Oh my god. Thank you. Now, let me just note that this game has like, I think, 500 rooms, 500 puzzle levels. Alright. Alright, here, let me, let me restart the room. Let's find out, let's do a little research. So these are going to close on me. These are going to close, these are going to close. And it looks like I need them to walk... Okay. Hmm. Can I... Is this one of these things where I have to be standing on it? Oh, whoops. I'm trapped in here. Okay. So, we need to enter into this room in a way that doesn't cause them to waltz out. Choose your entrance? Can I, can I like, drag him back into this room? Is that, is that what the puzzle is? What's the puzzle here? What's the puzzle here? Okay, so we need to get all three roaches standing on there. Right? Hmm. Ooh, this is tough. This is tough, but it's the Dark Souls of puzzle games. I'm not going to tell a lie. All right, what's 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 our goal? What are we trying to do? What's what's this one do? What's that? Oh, that one opens up all three. Okay. Okay, I got an idea. All right, so we're gonna do this. Oops. Okay, we're gonna try to bring him. Ah. Oh my god. Oh my god. Watch this. Watch this. Okay? Watch this. This is amazing. How do you get this roach back here, right? There's the puzzle. That's the puzzle. Here we go. Okay, Jarakal asks, what are the roach movement rules? He just moves towards you. So, for instance, if I move down to this square, his next move is going to be the shortest path to get to that square. Just directly towards you. Here we go. Okay, so I want him... Come on. Come on, little guy. So we're going to wait a little bit. We're going to get him stuck here. I'm going to give myself a little bit of space. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I, th I, think, I think we're getting close. Okay, so we, we got to... See, I'm trying to get him stuck on the wrong side of things. Because what I want, I want him to get stuck on here. How can we get him stuck here? But then not, you know, come kill us. Wait. Can we just... Can we just do like this? Okay, we already messed up. trying to get him to like oops damn it I'm trying to figure out how to get him to like stay even with us without me accidentally killing him killing his friendly roachy self because like i can for instance i can get down here Man, I really want him to follow me. This little roach hole. I don't want him dead. 
See, I can't, I, I it's just, it, the spacing is a little off. That he has to be actively standing on the. So here's here's my theory. I think I need him. I think I need him. Getting stuck over here somewhere. And then I need him to like sort of follow me around, maybe. Shit. <laughs> Now I'm gonna kill him. Damn it. Oh, oh, this is so hard. It's hard. This is like the fifth level. If you go farther down while he's stuck at the top, wouldn't that work? Oh, by the way, please, please give tips and anything you think, unless you've already beaten the game and you're just repeating a, a solved solution. We don't like that. We don't like that. We don't wanna. I think I think it's something like this. See, look, it, like, perfectly doesn't work. So what if we get him stuck down here somehow? If we did a, 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 a roundabout, it's, it's almost like, uh... Oh, wait, I think... Oh, wait, shit, 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 shit. It's like a chess where we need the opposition. Go right and come back in. Oh, oh, there's an interesting one right there. Okay, let, let, let's go through this. Let's do it. Let's go right and let's come back in. Come on, little roachy guy. Well, I think, I think we have the same problem, right? What, what if we what if we had the tip of our sword sort of facing? Oh wait, is this, is this how we do it? Is this how we... Where we adjust the way our sword's pointed? Okay, wait, what if I change like this? Okay, so we got... Shit, this isn't working. Oh god. I think you can corral him in. Maybe that's maybe that's it. Yeah, maybe we just maybe we just keep our sword pointed. We can corral him in. I don't think that works. All right. This is a toughie. This is toughie. So this is the puzzle. I think he wants us to choose which entrance we go through. But see, I'm uh, like, these these checkpoints are really confusing me. I'm, try, I'm trying to read into them, I'm trying to figure out what it wants me to do. Oh wait a damn minute! Can I do something weird where I? Trap the door. Ah. Hardest puzzle game, NA. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know what I did. I don't know what I did. I don't know what I did. What did I do? What did I do? Wait, what? How did that happen? How is he on that side now? How is he on this side? Oh my god. Wait, wait. How did this happen? We did it. I don't, I don't know what we did. What did I do? What did I do? Oh my god, we just dragged him around to the right spot. How? I don't even know. I don't even know. I'm gonna... I accept it. Oh my god, a secret room. I don't know. I don't know what I did. I don't know what I did. So this is a secret room. Uh, well, I'm just gonna ignore all secret rooms. I think I should have just killed them. This is pretty... Oh, this is an odd one. Uh, wait. Ooh. 
Wait, what? How do you do that? Wait, how, how, how do you... Okay, wait, it has to be on this left side. Or on the right side. How do you do this? That is hard as hell. So I think, yeah, maybe start start by facing one's six caliber, lure, lure another roach around. Oh my god. All right. Wait, wait. Okay, so I need to clear these guys out. I need to get this roach stuck. This roach needs to get stuck. And I need the roach to activate the pressure plate. Holy crap. Okay, so we do this. Now this roach is mine. This is my roach now. Oh, wait. Shit. Shit, 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 shit. Shit, shitty, crappity. Oh my god. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, yeah. Oh. I believe. All right. Now, I'm going to take a brief break. When we come back, we're going to do a little bit more Deadly Rooms of Deathing action. Just a little bit more. We're enjoying ourselves thus far. Put up a poll to see if we want to keep playing it all day. I could play it all day, but of course. Oof. Oof. But of course, it takes a particular amount of self-masochism. Like there's anything other than self-masochism. We'll be back in a bit. <laughs> 